left in the hills of Gallia County is a gem that will make your mouth water. Chocolate caramel cream, cinnamon sticky bun, dark chocolate cherry. These delicious delights can wrap you in comfort as you start your day. They are part of the pleasurable experience surrounding Silverbridge Coffee. We were lucky if we sold 10 bags a week and now we roast somewhere between 1,500 and 2,000 pounds weekly. This family-owned business continues to grow, adding jobs and fueling the local economy. They represent what any entrepreneur can do with hard work and dedication. Lorraine used the resources of the small business development centers in Piketon to help grow her business from the laundry room in her house to the roasting facility, now home to Silverbridge Coffee. We've worked very closely with them um, through the course of the last six to seven years, um, calling on them for um, advice. You're their biggest cheerleader, you know, to continue them going down that, that path of success. Um, but you try to keep them aware of what may impact that success along the road. While the end product appears effortless, to achieve these smooth and complex flavors, they leave nothing to chance. Like a fine wine, the coffee at Silver Bridge is selected, sampled, and swirled to ensure first-class flavor with every cup. Silver Bridge Coffee is one of 400 businesses helped by the Small Business Development Center at the OSU South Centers in Piketon. This SBDC is ready to help businesses big or small in their 10-county area that stretches from Gallipolis to Brown County. When we see a, a client go from starting their business to success, that is the most rewarding feeling that we have as a, a consultant when we work with a company.